What is going on guys, Gareth Collins here and welcome back to the channel. In the last video I showed you guys all of the damages as well as removed a few parts. If you haven't seen that video, I'll put the link in the description below. In this video I'd like to remove the front and rear wheel as well as the top yoke and the airbox. I'll see how much I get done in this video but before we do that, let's move the bike outside, clean off all of that dirt. So without further ado, let's get to work. So the bike's all cleaned up and I know a lot of you would disagree on the way I clean the bike and that's okay, we all have our way of doing things. I'm still in the process of stripping the bike so it's not like I'm going to leave all the water down there to rust or cause corrosion. But now that that's out of the way, let's go ahead and remove the entire airbox so that we can unplug the ignition and remove the top yoke.
Check this out guys, the top yoke and the airbox is removed and it is just disgusting in here. So I want to see if I can clean up most of this dirt and then go ahead and remove the front and rear wheel. So let's get to work.
All right guys, so it's actually the next day here and the reason for that is I needed a 22 millimeter Allen key to remove the front wheel. I didn't have this tool so I ended up removing a lot of the other parts and plastics. But this morning I quickly stopped at the hardware store and picked one up. So now that I have the tool, let's go ahead and remove the wheels. All right guys, the wheels are off and I'm probably gonna sand them down and spray them. I also wanna sand down the stator cover that I got as well as the clutch cover and spray that to match. I'm setting in this tank to have it sprayed to match the fairings that I've got for the bike. As well as the seat, they're gonna put on a new seat cover for me. And then I wanna change the spark plugs as well as remove the radiator, but that's only gonna happen in the next video. And so if you want to see that, make sure to subscribe, turn on your post notifications. You can also follow me on Instagram. Let's try to get 50,000 subscribers. 2020 can still be a great year, but for now, I'm out. Stay safe. Peace.